Welcome to the channel, Cooking with Chef Buka. Please don't forget, subscribe, share, like, tell a friend to tell a friend. Let's get into it. So yeah, we're back at it again. You know what I'm saying? I'm doing one of my favorite, one of the things that I love the most. You know what I'm saying? Because right now I'm not eating no meat, just straight fish and vegetable, and I'm about to cut fish out. So I'm making like a pumpkin soup, real pumpkin soup, a lot of pumpkin in there. You know what I'm saying? No flour, it's all gonna be all start. Check me out. Yeah, so I got pumpkin here chopped up, going in the pot. You know, that's gonna cook off. I'm gonna sweat this off with a little bit of onion for flavor. Then I'm gonna add the rest of my ingredients later. So we have banana, I got scallions, you don't know rasta, a lot of okros all the time. We got a lot more pumpkin right here. We got that fresh, you know, coconut milk right here. See that? VIP style, you know what I'm saying? We got peppers right here. In here we got yam and carrots. So normally with this soup, what I normally do is, you know, cut off a portion of the pumpkin. Sweat it off in here. And just use a little thing to kind of smash it up to kind of, that kind of build the base of the soup right there. So it's going to be rich consistent with pumpkin and then Later on, we just cut a couple of these and drop on the top. Five minutes steam, and it's ready to go. So what we're gonna do now, we're gonna go over here, put this on the stove, start sweating this off, then add two quarts of water in here, let it boil, till everything, you know, soft and nice, smash it up, then we start adding ingredients. Check me out. And don't forget, salt and pepper always as your ital. No salt, you can add mineral salt. But this is very nice, very delicious, very flavorful. Maybe I'm gonna add a little bit of spaghetti in there because I'm not doing no like dumpling or spinach in this one. I was thinking about doing some old wheat, weed, seed, dumpling, but I'm like, you know what? Let's crack the dumpling and let's go, you know? No gluten in this one today. So yeah, that's what I'm looking for. Right there, everything kind of caramelized and looking nice. So in here I add a little bit of pepper. A little bit of salt, you know what I'm saying? Skeleton is in there as well. Later on, I'm gonna go ahead and add a little bit of that special marinade that I always add to my recipe. So as I say, put two quarter water, I got water over here. You know, so I'm just gonna add two quarter water to get it going where I want it to be at. And then I'm just gonna smash the pumpkins or squash, whatever you guys call it. But this is, this is really pumpkin. So I'm gonna smash the pumpkin up, make it kind of give the the soup its kind of consistent on the body in there. You know what I'm saying? You'll see when I do it. All right? Just want you guys to see step by step because this is a very special soup to me. So here, yeah, this is what I was telling you about. Just let some of the pumpkin itself cook to kind of give it that kind of pumpkin flavor soup. And if you want to put it in the blend and puree, it, you can. But I, I like to just do mine in the pot like that to get it to that. So. What I'm going to do now, I'm going to add my coconut milk, add some more water to it, you know, to bring up the base. I'm going to peel my banana and all that and put it in there. Okros and vegetables going last, scallion again, season, you know, get it, let's get it going and flavor up and taste nice. So, when we come back, we're going to go back to the cutting board and show you what we're going to do a bit. And while this is boiling up, we're going to add some more water to it, get it going, all right? I'm gonna peel some banana. So what we normally do is put a little bit of oil in your hand. So, you know, it doesn't stain your hand so much. I'm gonna cut these in two because I'm gonna cut them into whichever way. I already sliced them before. So, with my finger to get it open. Then after the finger get it open, side of my finger right here. I rub it on it like that, you know? Some of them come out easy while some of them don't. Oh, it come easy, just like that. Cut off that right there. Put it in the water. Same thing for the rest of them. Get it up like that. And it's breaking off these. Start on the next side. So easy to peel, you know. So I say what I do, I just slice the little thing down in the, like that, you know? So I'll show you to peel the banana. Then what we're gonna do now is just take time, add the rest of the ingredients in there. 
First, we're gonna add yam and car carrots. Banana kinda going last. I only got one potato that going last. And then pumpkin gonna be simmer down on the top. Okra going last. We put a piece of skeleton over here. And I'm gonna drop some thyme in there like to finish seasoning it up. Cause it gotta be flavorful. Coconut milk go in there when it started to boil. So all that infusing everything. And if you have some beans, some peanuts, you can throw them in. 100% vegan friendly. 100% gluten free, you know. Very healthy. So I'm gonna peel some banana. So what we normally do is put a little bit of oil in your hand. So, you know, it doesn't stain your hand so much. I'm gonna cut these in two because I'm gonna cut them into whichever way. I already sliced them before. So with my finger to get it open. Then after the finger get it open, side of my finger right here. Rub it on it like that, you know. Some of them come off easy while some of them don't. Supposed to come easy. Just like that. Cut off that right there. Put it in the water. Same thing for the rest of them. Get it up like that. And it's breaking off these. So start on the next side. Easy to peel, you know. So I say what I do, I just slice little thing down in the, like that, you know. So I show you to peel the banana. Then what we're gonna do now is just take time add the rest of the ingredients in there. First we're gonna add yam and car carrots. Banana kind of going last. I only got one potato that going last, and then pumpkin gonna be simmer down on the top. Okra going last. We put a piece of skeleton over here. I'm gonna drop some thyme in there, like to finish seasoning it up. Cause it gotta be flavorful. Coconut milk go in there when it starts with the boil. So all that infusing everything. And if you have some beans, some peanuts, you can throw them in there. 100% vegan friendly, 100% gluten free, you know? Very healthy. So you see the color, like definitely pumpkin soup. So we're gonna go and drop some yam in there. I don't know why the yam like it change color more than normal. Mm-hmm. In Jamaica, these yam doesn't change like this, they stay only once you put them in the water, but we find out they eat the same anyway, so I ain't complaining for that. So we drop the yam them in there, let them cook, because these yam ain't gonna break out or get soft because they are yellow yam, they firm, they stay hard, so you can put them in there. So yam in, carrot, banana, waiting for a little bit. Now I'm gonna add my coconut milk. Make that flavor infused in there, you know. That's a fresh squeezed coconut milk right here. Yeah, you can notice that to see that. Yeah. Just like that. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna take away a little bit of the pumpkin flavor out of it, but that's what I wanted, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, when we come up, we're gonna get into adding the rest of the stuff, the okras and all of that, and let it simmer down. Alright, so yum 50% cook. Everything else right here. We'll take the rest of the time to cook carrots. It's not gonna you know, mash out so with carrots. These banana look like they're very hard as well too. So I'm gonna put them in. And even if I put them in and you realize they're overcooked, you're gonna just pop them out and then put them in back at the end when but you gotta pop them out fully cooked. Do not take them out if they're half cooked, okay? But these banana um, go in and take them out before they cook, they get it. So I'm going to put my okras in right now too. You know what? Okra going to stay for a bit longer. Alright, so seasoning again. Potato. More seasoning, more scallion. I'm saying I put some bay leaf in here too. Some thyme. Some of my green marinade special. I'm putting these peppers in too. So after this, go for like five minutes. Then I'm going to put in my okra and my pumpkin. Because my pumpkin is, you know, no skin, so it's easy to cook. It's going to take at least five minutes to put the okra. Five minutes. And then all of that, you know what I'm saying? Gumminess out of the okra going to go in the soup. I'm not even going to cut them. I want them just like that. So when I eat one, I can eat an old one, you know what I'm saying? Real talk. So yes, nice and lovely. So what I'm going to do now, I'm going to put in okras and then put this on top. Because five minutes and everything shall be ready. That's a pumpkin without skin. That's good. And if you feel like cover it down, you can cover it down. Normally what I do is put this side down like that. 
instead of this side because this side is easy more to cook because we normally repeat it we kind of make this a little bit harder than normal yeah so that's what we're working with right now yeah. get that going there Mm -hmm. Stay there and do what it do. Turn my flames up a bit more. Medium. When we come up, we're gonna get into when it's ready and make a plate. Definitely, I'm gonna get into it. Definitely into it because I'm hungry for this right now. So yes, you can see that you know pumpkin's coming where it's supposed to be at. You know, not ready yet. But the soup, look at that. Tick. Mm hmm. Rasta man pumpkin soup, look how thick it is, I'm telling you. Carrot them coming as well, losing this greenness. You don't want them lose too much greenness. So we're not gonna cook them too much. I'm gonna cook it for five more minutes and then it's gonna be ready. Mm-hmm. Smell real good though. I'm them some. That's the end of the video. Don't forget, like, share, hit the notification bell. Tell a friend, tell a friend. Peace.